If you're a Walsall tenant looking for a three bedroom detached property on a very popular estate in South Walsall, I think we found the ideal property for you. Right, so we're here on the Tambridge estate in South Walsall, WS5 area. Um, this is a very popular estate with commuters. If you look down this side of Woodruff Way, this leads up onto Greenside Way and turns left into the dual carriageway where you've got the routes into Walsall and West Bromwich town centres. Um, also, you've got the Tambridge Parkway uh, park and ride train station, which is a, a very popular thing for this estate um, for commuters. Basically, what you can do is you can go and park your car um, for free and then travel into Birmingham, uh, do your work, come back, pick up your car and co come back into it. You can actually walk from here. There's many little routes that goes off into little these um, splinter roads, I call them, and they go into uh, the back end of the Tambridge Parkway station. Now, if you look to this side, this is taking you up to the Utree State. There's schools over there for uh, the Utree Junior School. You've got the Dells Junior um, nearby, the Q3 Academy uh, for secondary schools, the Joseph Lecky as well. Um, so schools for all ages, very popular with families on this estate. So if you turn towards the house, this is now um, the property itself. Um, it's a three bedroom detached property. Um, you can see there's plentiful parking for several cars. It's all been block paved. We've had long term tenants here for about 10 years. They stayed with us and have now vacated, uh, moved on to different pastures and the property has now become available. Uh, garage. It's not an integral garage. You go in from the outside. You can come in from the garden side. You can come in from this side as well. And I'll take you into the property and show you around now. So, little stone porch into a uh, lobby area. Got laminate flooring which leads into the lounge. So you can see the lounge is of a good size opens up into the dining area, which we'll go to in a second. I'll just close the door behind us. Okay, so a good space here. Basically, because we've got a dining section over there, I don't think you need to have any dining stuff over here, but you could have if you chose to. You could have it in that section where the camera's turning to right now, over here. Uh, there's a door which kind of leads, um, if you stay there, there's a door that leads into the kitchen from there. So, you know, you could have a dining table over here. Um, but, you know, I'd put sofas down, to be honest, lounging uh, stuff over there by the bay window as well. Really good size room. There we go. And then if we come in through here, we've got the dining kitchen. So, obviously, that leads onto the conservatory. That's the best aspect of this house, in my opinion. I quite like, I'll show you the conservatory in a bit, uh, but uh, for me, that's a, a really double bonus to have that in this house. Um, so you've got this dining kitchen, all floors are tiled, uh, fitted uh, kitchen with an integrated oven hob. You've also got a dishwasher over here as well, uh, which is integrated. You've got space over here for a washing machine, under the counter, fridge. Um, there's also a space over there by the dining room where the previous tenants had um, the, the tall kind of fridge freezer in that space over there. Um, there's also down this side, we've uh, got the uh, toilet. I'll let the camera just go in there. You've got an additional uh, kind of guest WC where it also houses the um, gas fired combination boiler. So the property is obviously centrally heated and um, double glazed as well. Okay. So once you're ready, I'll take you to my favorite part of the house, which is the conservatory, if you'd like to come through. I mean, this is a full length conservatory. You know, so it's the length of the house, the whole span, uh, the whole width from left to right. And it's probably about what, 12 feet or something, um, 12, 13 feet. Um, in, in, in width and yeah, I mean, it's a really good family space. 
Um, you've got kind of electric points on a couple over there, double sockets over there, double sockets over here, double sockets on that side. Um, yeah, really like this face. Gives you um, an extra dimension to the living quarters. Okay, so the garden. Let me just open this up if I can. No, let's just leave that. Okay, so just a quick tour of the garden. You've got um, obviously some block paving, there's some lawned area. To be honest with you, the cons conservatory kind of swallowed up uh, the size of the garden, but it's still a decent space to come out and enjoy some sunshine, uh, some barbecue maybe uh, or something in the summertime. Uh, to this side, if the camera just comes over here and just shows you where the exit is for your side gates, that's where you would bring in your bins and, and stuff. So that's out to the, to the back that way. Okay, now we'll take you inside and take you upstairs. Oh, that's your Honeywell thermostat for the um, digital thermostat for, to contro controlling the room temperature. Um, the property is alarmed. The alarm control panel is kind of on this wall, so if the camera can probably just show that over here. And the stairs go off from the lounge. So the first room you come to, to your left side, is the family bathroom. Right, so your standard kind of wash and basin, uh, kind of fitted in vanity unit with your um, WC and a full kind of bath. Okay, this room over here, this room over here is, ju is just um, where the used to be the hot water tank. I'll just open it briefly. So you've got like an airing cupboard. They haven't removed the, um, the old... Uh, Gled Hill kind of used to be a system boiler before, but obviously we've got a combination boiler now. Uh, but that's more of a airing cupboard. This is the master bedroom, which is uh, front facing, so it's facing the road. As you can see, I mean that's Woodruff Way, but you can't really hear uh, the road traffic. It's, it's nicely and well insulated. Um, you've got fitted kind of uh, furniture you can see around the the, the room. A fitted wardrobe over there, a dressing table, a couple of bedside tables, and then to this side you've got the uh, ensuite shower room. Fully tiled on all walls, and you can see to the right, I'll push the door when the camera gets in, that's the, there's an electric shower with a good size shower unit. Okay. So in essence you've got three toilets in this house, the guest WC, the ensuite and the family bathroom and this is the second of the bedrooms. A really good size, comfortably get a double bed in here, you've got the fitted wardrobes, I mean these are you know they're functional, you've got kind of clothes you can put at the top, at the bottom, some boxes at the top over there. Um, yeah, and from here, this one obviously is facing the garden. So you can see the conservatory from here in the garden as well. Okay, so that's the second bedroom. And lastly, the smallest of the three. I say small, but again, it's a really good size. These are both facing the back of the house. Uh, it's a really good size, you know, you can, you can see, you can get a comfortably a single bed in. You'd really be able to squeeze a double bed in, but you won't be able to get much more into this property. But uh, yeah, it's a good, comfortable size, and, um, size, size of bedroom. So, okay, I think that's the complete house that we've shown you. Um, thank you very much for watching this video tour. I think we'll end the video tour over here. Um, if uh, you wish to proceed to an application with this property, we'll have the forms and stuff on our website. Please see all the links in the description. 
Um, give us a telephone call, send us an email, go through our website and register. There's various routes that you can go um, to inquire about this. And hopefully if you uh, do uh, think about subscribing to the channel as well, um, because we all put all, our, all of our properties go on to this, um, to the YouTube channel first, to our social media and all that, to our registered applicants on our database uh, through our website. Um, so do subscribe, do go and register with us. Uh, you'll get first dibs before properties go on to the open market. Uh, all being well, if you, this is something that interests you, we look forward to seeing you on the other side. So thank you for watching again and take care. Talk soon.